Starting tomorrow, get ready for huge art exhibits to take over downtown Scottsdale. Uh, yeah, and get this, it's all free. It's a display called Canal Convergence. And Jessica Parsons is showing us this Arizona-inspired work of art that's attracting artists from all over the world. Good morning. Good morning, that's right. So there are art pieces all over the valley like this one that you could see everywhere, but a new one created by a Boston couple will have you feeling like a kid again and totally in awe. The artwork that you're looking at is called Arizona with a big exclamation mark at the end. We wanted to capture the beauty the beautiful nature, the force of nature that created this beautiful uh, land called Arizona. Jin Chow and Thomas Shine are college sweethearts. They've mastered marriage of architecture and the fluidity of artistry with the largest crochet art in the world. This is the biggest project we've done. Um, the largest one before this was in Dubai. And this one is three times the size of that one. This is custom made rope. It's taken hundreds of volunteers to put this crochet piece together. And when it's all done, it's going to light up the entire canal. So that's what you're looking at. Undulating form of lace is um, the idea of this uh, wind and water that carved out the land. The architects who met at Yale have been married for 15 years, and their partnership in business and life is taking them and their land art around the globe. Jin has a background in art, and I have a background in engineering. So it's a really nice way for us to come together and work on the projects. In 2010, their concept for Iceland's high voltage towers known as the Land of the Giants became award winning. Last year, their crochet urchins dangled for a Singapore festival. And in Amsterdam, their project Under the Lace put them on the map. And see it with my naked eyes has been the most exciting and emotional experience, yes. Just sewing these pieces together was three weeks in the making. And the lace is symbolically weaving all these different people together and different culture together. In Arizona, Canal Convergence will extend 10 days this year. You'll see giant sculptures along the canal featuring artists as far as Australia and Hungary. And throughout Old Town Scottsdale, local artists will take over with interactive designs. Ultimately, as, as we move on um, into coming years, we really want to take over Scottsdale and just really invigorate it with art. The crown jewel, the Crochet Arizona piece, will span from bridge to bridge. It's a project that took Thomas and Jin a year and a half and 300 expert and beginner crocheters who all volunteered. So I go in between nervous, what's going to happen next, and then uh, of course, the other end is very overwhelming to see. The couple says their artwork is about transforming a familiar space with new energy, a love affair with creativity they hope you can't live without. That transformation will hopefully become a reminder for everyone who visits here of the beauty of where you live. Now you can start experiencing canal convergence starting tomorrow for the next 10 days. And an interesting side note, some of those volunteers included 10 fraternity brothers who had never crocheted before. They now have a Facebook group with all the volunteers and they're still bonding over this newfound skill. That is cool. Yeah, that's really wild. <laughs> cool. Jessica, thank you. Even more to enjoy yeah, in Scottsdale. Really. Thank you.